Most people believe that we come into this world alone and we leave this world alone. However, the following story may make you think twice. A Pelsall resident who I interviewed some years ago told me about a rather strange experience he had at a local hospital. Mr D had been admitted to hospital to have a triple bypass operation and was recovering in a ward of around 10 men, all of whom were waiting to have operations or recovering after having had their operation. Mr D recalled that a couple of days after the operation the weather took a turn for the worse resulting in a foul night following a dark, rainy day. As the evening drew in and Mr D was propped up in bed, he suddenly became aware of movement to the left of him. Mr D was in a bed next to the window. As he looked to his left, he watched a smoky figure emerge from the window, then reappear at the bottom of his bed. Mr D looked on in terror. The figure which he took to be a woman, was pointing down the ward and continued to drift to the doorway, calling out the name Mary until it disappeared. Mr D was shocked and couldn't believe his eyes. At first he thought he had dropped off to sleep and dreamt the whole thing until the young man in the bed right opposite to his shouted across to him, Did you see that? The apparition had clearly been neither a dream or a hallucination since the same apparition was witnessed by two people at the same time. To their relief, it seemed that the apparition had come to collect someone called Mary who had just passed over. To both of them, this was proof enough that we do not leave this world alone. Following a conversation with a retired nurse many years ago, you may be surprised to learn that out of respect for a newly deceased patient, a nearby window is usually opened to release the spirit.